Alright, what's up everybody? I'm Casey of the BDLA and um, welcome to my channel. As you guys can see, I'm doing a face cam for the series because why not? Uh, first time doing it, so hopefully I don't screw up too bad. Anyway guys, um, today is May 20th, 2017 and like I promised, here is a new series for my channel. Which if you guys can't read this, it says Fable the Lost Chapters. Um, I haven't played this game in years. I tried to do um, a let's play on my old channel, but it, the first episode got flagged, so... Hopefully this one does better. Anyway, so yeah, hope you guys enjoy, and let's get right to it. Alright, we're gonna start with a new profile uh, for this this series. Um, we'll go just KC2. <laughs> Short, sweet, and to the point. Resurrection vials are one of the most valuable objects in Albion. They will shatter when you die, bringing you back to life instantaneously. Cheat death. <laughs> okay, if you say so, game. <laughs> I love playing this game. Deep in the forest of Albion, lay the small town of Oakvale. Unchanged by time, and untouched by the sword. For how long? <laughs> Here lived a boy and his family. A boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Bum, bum, bum. There we go. I've lost <laughs> Rosie! I, I left her and I can't remember where. Aww. Her stuffing needs changing today and I can't find her. Please help. Okay, we'll help She's you. She's a lovely little furry bear with a blue patch on her back. Alright. So this is one of the... Um, many quests we can do around town. Oh, 
um, I'm, I've never even met this woman. Who is she? Uh-oh. You look pretty guilty, dude. Look, Sonny, keep your mouth shut about this, right? No. My wife's at home with our little ones, and I'm supposed to be working. Hmm. Will you take his bribe and commit a bad deed? No. Just don't tell my wife. I can't let her find out about this. Oh, too late, buddy. Way too late. Anyway, so... Here's that huge wave. We're gonna go by the mountain immediately. Filthy layabout husband of mine. <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. Smart. I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Nothing. I'm sorry. If you find him, let me know, won't you? Yeah, I will. And I'm gonna tell you about him right now. <laughs> you have? Right. I'm gonna turn him into Balverine food. Good luck. Thank you, young sir, for telling me. You're welcome. Oh, hey, our first good deed. I think we need to do four of them. Wait till I get his mother will be pleased with his behavior. Um, I think we need four of them to get um, oh, our me. sister's birthday present. All right, here's our next oh. one. Oh, thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do me a favor? What do you need? I've got to, you know, answer a call of nature. Oh, stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Sure, that sounds fun. Just stand between those two stacks and don't move. Doesn't sound hard. I'll put a good word in for you when I get back. Well, thanks, dude. Right, won't be long. So yeah, we just gotta stand here and do nothing until that time runs out. That the barrels in these warehouses might have stuff in them. Is that right? Quick, while he's away, smash his barrels up and see what's inside. Mmm, nah. Yeah. Unless you're too scared. Unless you're just a big blubbing girl. Ooh, 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 maybe I should hit you instead. Come on, let's go and break stuff. But yeah, I'm just not even gonna move. I'm just, I'm, just gonna, like a lemon. I'm just gonna stand here. <laughs> yeah. But being good is so boring. Maybe, but it's got good rewards. Would you prefer <laughs> to be smashing things? Anyway, so yeah, in this game, Come it really on, makes um makes back. a difference on your actions. Um, if no, you choose to be no good or evil, it really affects how other people see you. And I'm gonna try and go for a good guy. I've never tried being evil on purpose, Fine. but Good I'm gonna be a then. good guy today. It's my birthday. <laughs> oh, here he comes. Excellent, thanks, lad. You've done me a big favor. You're welcome, dude. I'll let your dad know what a splendid watchman you made. All right, that's two down. All right. So yeah, this is basically what we're going to be doing for this uh, first episode. I know it's kind of boring, but don't worry, it'll kick off pretty soon. You stupid little idiots. Uh oh. I this doesn't look nice. <gasps> Get him off me! <gasps> Please help! He goes around the town beating up anyone smaller than him. But you look strong. I bet you could scare him off for good. Shall we beat up the bully? Why are you playing with oh, baby toys and little girls? Have you cleaned my mum's car for me yet? Yeah, we'll you beat him up. Stupid little it hurts! It hurts! What are you do? There we go. I'm sorry. I'll leave him alone. Just please don't hit me again. <laughs> yeah, you better one. Thank you. You stopped him good. Thank you. You're welcome. Here, I'll let you look after Rosie. She'll be safe with you. Oh, he had a You 
so much. Oh, you're so welcome. Come on, Mosey. Let's change your stuffing. Stock available. All right, I think that's all the good deeds we can do here, so... Let's go talk to our Stock daddy. Available. <laughs> oh, sorry, dude. You what? Alrighty. But before we do that, I want to explore our house. Harvest day, or oh, harvest day 15. Mother is away again, she never told us where. I think father is a little sad when she goes. Harvest day 18. I had that nightmare again last night. There's a big room, and right in the middle of it there's a big old swooshing light. It feels like it's gonna suck me in. I still couldn't see what's in the middle of it. I don't think I want At least mother will be back. I'll get up early to look over the sea. And now I'm gonna go play in the top field. Hmm. That doesn't sound... There we go. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, once I figured out how to run, I'd run. Hello, lad. I'm a trader. I wander the world buying and selling wares, especially to find folk like your good self. Nice mustache. Some little girl I saw said you have a sister, and it's her birthday. Hmm. And it seems you haven't got her a present yet. You don't know that. It just so happens that I have a rather nice box of sweets here. Really? Guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face for only three gold pieces. Neat. Uh, yeah. Young sir, they are yours. Wish your sister a happy birthday from me now, won't you? Okay. I'm sure she'll be happy to hear that from a complete stranger. Oh, we still got one, so that's nice. He does his family proud, that lad. Oh, if only all kids was like him. All right, so let's go talk to our sister. Thank God, man. <laughs> and there she is. Oh. Hello, little brother. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is. Like you did last year. <laughs> I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. I was standing in this field when something happened. But I can't remember what. Never mind that though. I'm still waiting for my present. Hmm, should I give her her birthday present or not? I knew you were going to bring me chocolates. It's just like my dream. Really? Come on. Let's go home. Mother will be back for my party any minute now. Alright. So I guess we're going to a birthday party now. Wait. There's something wrong. Like what? Bandits! It's really happening. They're here. You've got to hide. Oh, 
That's not good. Got one. Wow, all those bandits are blind. If they turned right, they would have been able to see him. Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets. That's so sad. Then the raiders reached the last house where the boy and his family lived. It was them they had slaughtered so many to find. Why? <laughs> the father fought to protect. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. Oh. He was alone. Aww. So yeah, this just got dark in a hurry. <laughs> and now we gotta run through our burning village. And you can just see the corpses of people lying on the ground. Night Guardsman didn't really do a whole lot. You know, I'm surprised this bridge hasn't collapsed already. I mean, it's completely on fire. Okay, thought we could see someone. Oh, there's Dad. leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. Ooh. I love this game. It's so much fun to play again. You'd have a stronger Ew, stomach than that. The vomit? Come on. <sighs> Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. Yeah, be grateful, dude. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Wow. Come with me. He's, he's as blunt as a two by four. My name is Maze. And I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. Mm -hmm. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Mm. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs with the girl. You don't look much like hero material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. The guild master kind of reminds me of Pixis uh, from Attack on Titan. Just, just a little bit. You'll be sharing this room with Whisper, one of our brightest young pupils. She's playing in the woods right now. 
but you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should get some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. Yeah. All right. Yeah, you, you cry, buddy. You can cry. Because all that happened so fast, he never really had a time to grieve. It's time to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. <laughs> my name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. But that's all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. Ooh. You want either if you don't Ominous. get moving. The guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. Is he? You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. Oh, uh, we'll, we'll get to that later. Well, now I guess. Hmm. Looks like the guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. Mm. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go! Alright, but um, actually you guys, that's where I'm going to leave it off this episode. Next episode we're going to start our guild training. <laughs> so if you guys like, like this episode, leave a like on the video, comment down below, uh, subscribe if you haven't already, and um, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy this episode, and I'll see you guys for the next episode, which, um, haven't decided when I'm going to post the next episode. What, what day I'm going to do that. We'll, we'll see. Depends on how popular this video gets. Anyway, you guys, I'll see you next time.